What's up guys, it's Icy Infernape, and welcome back to the Pokemon Crown Tundra Let's Play for Sword and Shield. So, we finished off last time down here doing the, oh, wrong button, doing the, um, Dynamax Adventures, and we just got out. Oh, and I just spun. Did not mean to do that. Look at these, I forgot what those, I almost called a Charger Bug. I forgot what those are called, honestly. Let's go wake this guy up. Ah, it hurts. It ultra mega hurts. Nia, where's my darling Nia? So what happened? This fine gentleman appears to have tripped on a rock and struck his head. Poor guy. It's tough, man. That's tough. I don't even know how to just make, make that noise. Like, I don't know. It's not like a Minecraft villager. Anyway, adventures aren't to be taken lightly. I learned that firsthand now. First head now. First time. See, I can't even like keep up with this, dude. I'm so stupid. I'm also really tired. It's kind of late when I'm recording this, but whatever. Checking to see if my little girl is behind some rocks, and look how I've ended up behind some rocks. Is your daughter a Roly Coley, sir? There we go. I'm up. No little bump's gonna keep me down long. That Kip's got me feeling. Fighters for okay. See, should I even like? I don't know. I'm not even gonna read the dialogue. I think that's probably just annoying, and obviously you guys can see it on screen. I sound like a robot reading the dialogue. Plus, like, I don't know. I sound really dumb when I read stuff out loud because I probably read it wrong. So it looks like now we have to go on an adventure with Peony. I wonder where Nia went though. That's my name. And this guy obviously forgot we met him. Peony's lead card. So this will give us like some information about him to see who he is. Let's have ourselves a smashing adventure that I do need to be itching to join the fun. See, I said I was not gonna read off this, but I don't know. I feel like I should be saying something during this. I feel like it's kind of awkward, just I'm not really saying anything. Let's get ourselves to Freezington. So this is like, almost like a whole other region almost. Was, I don't know if the Isle of Armor was. The Isle of Armor seems kind of weird to me. And not weird, it just kind of felt like a big wild area. You know, it, it just kind of felt empty. But, I don't know, the Crown Tundra. Again, I didn't play much of the uh, Isle of Armor, so I can't really say much about it, but the Crown Tundra is already interesting me more. Just the whole, like, aesthetic of it. I like the whole, like, winter theme, you know? Man, running fast. Is this Freezington? Okay, what Pokemon we find here? Mora, Cryogonal, Bomba Snows. More of the same stuff we found the last episode. It is like the same area. There's still that double raid. Got my bike down here. item that I want to get. So this is Freezington. It's literally like two houses. Kind of a neat little town though. Oh, who's this? Mayor of this town of Freezington. Does he have a name or is he just called Mayor? Legend of the King of Bountiful Harvests. Maybe here. Oh, okay. Not uh, sure. What was it? That's why I'm here. That's why I'm here. Oh, this Freezington specialty is a memento. 
freezing, freezing ten frames, freezing, dude, I can't even say anything, like, I'm so, like, alright, I'm not gonna, like, read the text or anything, it's obviously just gonna make this even more awkward than it already is, I don't know, only when I watch people's Let's Plays, there's so much, like, very interesting, I'm like, they're just, like, simple, you know, it's just someone playing the game and talking, I'm trying to do that, but, I don't know. We'll figure this out. Figure out what I want to do. Looks like a mud still right there. Is there like a new Galarian mud still or something? Oh! Yo! Hold up, do we get following Pokemon now? Is that Peony's house? He's got like a flag there. Like if it's like logo or whatever. Hold up, I wanna see how we can another Pokemon follow us. Who would I want following us? Yeah. Um How do we do this? Can we swap it? Maybe it's like the first one in your party is the one that follows you? Oh, yeah. That's cool. I don't know why they can't, like, implement this in their main game. But, hey, I'll take it here. It's pretty neat. This is one of the coolest things about Let's Go. The following Pokemon. Yeah, it's, it's really cool. Actually, can we change our outfit? Uh, can we even do that? I think we have to go to like a clothing store to do that. Or league card do we go to? It's been a while since I've done this. Um, yeah, let's take a look at Peony's league card. Former steel type gym leader. He's gonna steal Peony. Am I saying his name right? Is his name Peony or Peony? I mean, your favorite that. So I don't, I don't know, I don't really like wearing the I Love Armor clothes. Like, they're cool, I guess, but it doesn't really fit for being in the Crown Tundra. I'm just gonna see Peony's house. Chokey Place would be all the large Base camp. The Peony Exploration Team. I wonder what that is. A huge headed Pokemon known as the King of Bountiful Harvest. That's what the mayor was talking about. Massive Red Tree with a legendary flying Pokemon gathering. So it seems like the Crown Tundra is like. Basically, just finding a bunch of legendaries. We already got one. We have Suicune. I wonder if, like, every legendary ever is here. Probably not, like, the mythicals, but, like, the actual, like, legendaries. That'd be pretty neat. Expedition Chief Matt. Okay, I guess I'm the expedition chief. I wonder where Nia went to. She just ran away from her dad and he doesn't really seem to care much. Interesting. You need to hold down the fort chief. Oh, wrong button. Oh, and I pressed the wrong button again. I am an idiot. Expedition uniform. Nice. Oh yeah, we looking fresh. We looking fresh. I don't like the hair though. I don't like that. Uh, like the Isle of Armor hair.
legendary clue one. I wonder what that is. It's a key item. Clue about the King of Bountiful Harvest. It's written by Peony and old photos attached to it. Oh, okay, so I thought it was like a Mudsdale or something, but but like there's like that legendary Pokemon that they like revealed a couple months ago. The like deer looking one with a thing on its head. I forgot its name. Alright, legendary clue two. Whoa, what's okay. Wait a lot of what the... Okay, so giant bed. Snow slide slope. That sounds like an interesting place. The giant of ice sleeves. Oh, these must be the Reggies. Giant, so that's Reggie Rock, Reg Ice, and this must be Reggie Steel. And this is probably Reggie Gigas, right? We're two giant sleep. Two of them. So it's not Regigigas then. I don't know. Okay, so is he just giving us all like the legendary clues, which like are all like shows all the legendary Pokemon you can get. If sun reaches its zenith and it shines there. Legendary. Moves. Oh, uh, that um, it's like Moltres. Probably. Uh, I feel like it seems like it'd be Moltres. Whoa, the sacred bones of Sovereign and Steed. That came out of nowhere. Okay. You want to change back in your usual clothes? No, I'll go with this. I like this. Oh, another Master Ball. I think we got, we got one in the Isle of Armor as well. So I think I just have like three Master Balls chilling. Here, we're going to see if we can change the hairstyle. Oh, you can restore the Pokemon. Change my armband. What's that do? Oh! A different color. Oh, ice type color. That would go well with the Crown Tundra. Blueprint. No, I like my lead card. Oh, okay. Oh, that's actually kind of neat. Uh, can I just change, like, the hair? Do I have to go to like... I don't like this hair. Whatever. It's not a big deal. So let's just go check out the statue. I think that's what he told us. Alright. Or are we supposed to go out there? So this isn't like frozen area. That's like actual like grass. Really like this so far. Like, I feel like it's more like cinematic than like the Isle of Armor was. Like, this has already got me like more like hooked on it. I guess like this makes you want to keep playing. He comparing it to the Isle of Armor because it's all I really like can't compare it to, you know, it's like the first time Pokemon's had DLC. And yeah, this is the second pack. So there's only two things to compare each other to. I have no idea what I'm even saying anymore. Probably really confusing everybody. But yeah, so we got the legendary clues now, so that'll probably do it for this episode. So in the next episode we'll go do what we need to do with those legendary clues so thank you guys for watching and once again i can keep say, like i keep saying in the videos just comment below what i oh that's cool the way the oh, it just jumps anyway 
comment below what I could do better in these videos. And yeah, thank you guys for watching.